hello viewers welcome back to my youtube channel this is eddie and princely and indeed it's a very sunny and hot sunday i wish you a happy sunday and i wish you all the best of joy and excitement happiness prosperity in this uh, month of celebration uh, the month of december i'm right here in nigeria you can see i'm sitting outside my bedroom because we, we don't have light anyway we don't have electricity light so the room is very hot i can't even stay inside so i have to come outside to prepare my food so you can see this is my backyard um this is my backyard the little garden i'm trying to plant some green vegetables around here i just come out to sit here because the sun is shed so that i can do these things and feel some kind of uh, cool air outside today in the video i want to show you very unique seafood or sea creatures that okay. you've been eating and it's very nice and i'm right here in the video with my little baby sharon baby sharon say hi guys say hi guys to your people okay so today i am using this sea creature in a group of lobsters look at it okay it is look at it actually i don't know what this is called in english but i believe it has an english name if you have come across it we all have the native way we call it like in my own dialect we call it ukonko it can be found in the swampy area and this one was picked from one of those swampy area those riverine area where they have swamp and mangrove kind of forest so you can find this um, sea creature or sea animal it is very good to health it is believed in this part of the world in our own culture that this contains selenium it. it contains selenium it contains um calcium it contains calcium it contains b12 it also contains a lot of ingredients that if somebody is anemic or somebody is having this cancer at the early stage once you keep on taking this using it to boil to cook and eat it as pepper soup and be drinking the water it can help to kill that cells and also good for inflammation in fact this is an all-round kind of health so we normally put it in our own soup or in a pepper soup or sauce they call it nkonko it's very good to taste it has its natural sweetness as if you are putting as if you are putting cube in your food it has this natural sweetness just like periwinkle and it doesn't have it does not select cultures or select scribe anybody can make use of it so if you need it you can contact me and i am ready to provide it to you at affordable price don't know putting it in your own food putting in your own soup because it is far more better than all this uh, red meat that people consume when you put all these sea creatures in your food you have really helped yourself to build your body immune system this also strengthens the immune system because it's a natural organic something that comes from the sea it does not have any any chemical or anything that is put on it to make it grow so this is I'm going to use it to prepare the meal soup that I'm preparing today and that soup is green editan soup so this thing is, is picked from I'm trying to imagine how come about the shell of this how come about this shell because this shell to me I feel is indestructible as in it takes so many years for this shell to be crushed or decayed you can see since it is that natural ingredient it is very very good and unique to one's health so like now the world water will actually be boiling and at a certain boiling point you will put it and put it and cover it keep it so, so that that was the process i did it before and then after it i keep the water to cool when i keep the water to cool i now remove that water out to remove it out from this shell so what do you use to remove it from the shell? You use needle. This is my needle. I use needle to remove it out from the shell. I've removed some already. Using needle. After 
now boiling it with hot, very hot water. I boiled it, I drained out the water, and now I am removing it. When you remove, you will see one black thing at the back. You have to remove that black thing. They call it the thing of the nkonko. Remove that black. Look at it, I'm removing. 